Welcome everyone to a brand new tutorial series on HTML and CSS. My name is Vishwas and in, this, and in the first half of this video series we are going to be learning about HTML and in the second half of this video series we are going to be learning about CSS. Now if this is your very first tutorial series on HTML then HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language and it is the most widely used language to create web pages. So if you guys ever want to create your own website or even better become a web developer, then this tutorial series is a great place to start. All right, then let's begin with an analogy. Now I'm no, I'm no biologist, but we all know that the human body consists of a skeletal system. And this skeletal system defines the structure of our body. So the head goes on the top and then we have the body and at the bottom we have the feet. Now on top of our skeletal system, we have the muscles, a layer of skin and hair and etc. And this defines the visual style of the human body. Now similarly, HTML defines the structure of our web pages and CSS defines the visual style of our web pages. So together, if you combine HTML and CSS, you can create awesome websites. Now, before we create our very first website, let me explain this to you. So we have our skeletal system, and we know that the skeletal system is made up of 206 bones. So if you learn about each bone one by one, and then you put together what you have learned, then you basically end up knowing the entire skeletal system. Now in the same way, HTML is made up of something called as a tag and there are more than a hundred of them and by learning each one of these tags and then putting them together you end up knowing HTML as a whole it's as simple as that now before we start creating our website what we need is a text editor now you can make use of notepad but I highly recommend using something like notepad plus plus or sublime text which is which has syntax highlighting and is more advanced so I'm gonna be using sublime text for this tutorial series but feel free to use a text editor of your choice so go ahead and download either notepad plus plus or sublime text or any other text editor you're comfortable with and in the next video we are going to shift gears and then dive right into learning some tags and then building a very first web page Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video.